guy right here is me. I am, I'm me. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm just innocent me. This guy right here is the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit is on go. And you know what he tells me? He says, you know what? You gonna live for God because that's what you wanna do. You wanna live for God. That's what you wanna do. So basically, what you gonna do is you gonna, you gonna, you gonna do what I tell you. And the things that I tell you, they gonna look, they gonna make you look real crazy. They gonna make you, because this is me. This is me. But he's like, the things that I tell you to do is gonna make you look real crazy. But you gonna do it anyway. So that means if I say drop down on your knees, bow down to the Father, you gonna do that. And no, no, no. He's like, and even if you don't, even if you don't feel like it, you gonna do it anyway. You just, you just gonna do what I tell you to do. And I'm like, okay, me, I made that decision to listen to him. So I'm like, okay, so I'm willing to let him use me to, to do whatever I gotta do because that's what he's telling me to do. But I made a decision, listen to this guy. But this guy right here is watching this guy look like he's making a fool out of himself. And, but this guy is also watching this guy experience things in his life that he has never experienced before. And this guy is like, wow. All this guy says is, wow. Wow, like I carry in myself a voice that is always wowing, almost doubting what's going on in my life. Really, wowing and doubting. This guy is coaching, telling me to do stuff, and this guy is looking foolish. But he said he has you use the foolish things to confound the wise. So this guy is blowed away.